um, yeah. Father Arden says, oh, my God, um, uh, I did not lock the front doors of the church. Oh, oh, Father Arden. OK, well, um, um, so we think some of these may be in the church. Let's. Um, uh, um, I, I'm just I, yeah. I didn't really think of it. I came running out when you guys I didn't expect you guys to do what you did. You're you're like amazing people. I, you have saved me in the town. I just. But now when you think about it, it's all of a sudden there's oh, I, I don't know what to do. I'm, I'm, I'm a little at a loss right now. Um, Sammy doesn't say anything. She, he just, he just hands Ramsey's because he sees Ramsey's bleeding out uh, his uh, healing potion. He doesn't okay. even say anything. Ramsey's without even saying lugga, lugga, lugga. He just, he just, he just, he just drinks the um um healing potion. Um, is it a is it one d six plus plus one? Yes. All right. Well, I rolled a. No, I rolled a three. So three plus one is four. So he's down. He's still down one. Okay. All right. Darn it. He's not. He's not back up. But anyway, he's. But he's at a. He's. He's. He's at a minus one. Um, Larry's at a minus three. Benedict's at a minus six. Oh crap. Well. Anyway, um, they don't even. They don't even say anything. They just like um, kind of look to each other. They just nod kind of um, kink their gear a little bit and they start walking to the back door. <laughs> this is, this to is, the back door? Yeah, this is this is this is why we get dressed up, right? Okay, um, all right, cool. Um so um so they hear some so they heard something in there. Sammy's gonna go in first and he's going to kind of try to sneak. Uh, he right. wants to take a look and then behind him is going to be Larry. Then of course uh, Benedict and Ramsey's going to be bringing up the bringing up the rear. Okay, so go ahead and uh, you're going to d6 roll these things. So Sammy gets yeah. three, right? He's sneaking. Let's see what yeah, he, he gets. He gets. He gets. He gets three, and he's going to. He's trying to be quiet. He's trying to see what because you said there's a hissing sound. I hope he doesn't knock over a shovel. Yeah, he rolled two fives and a and a one. Okay, so, well, okay, he's, yeah, he's he quiet enough. What, what what about Larry? Larry. Oh, Larry is. Uh, Larry does have a dex of eighteen, um, but I think he only gets two. Yeah, a one and a three, so that's nice. He's fine. Okay, how about Ramsey? Ramsey only gets one, I, I believe. I don't know. Oh, I rolled a one. Nice. Okay, so now it's down to Benedict. Benedict wearing his silver chainmail with his silver share shield and his. Oh, yeah, he lost his helmet. Um. Oh, he rolled a two. Holy crap! Okay, you guys Good are rolls. all in. This is awesome. Yeah. All right. So they don't even know you're there. So you're gonna. So, so and Sammy's gonna. He's just trying to peek through the that door, but he doesn't want to see if he can be noticed. All right. Uh, Father Arden's bring up the rear, and he is not going to be rolling because yeah. he's just in clo clo yeah, He does yeah, not. Yeah. So he's he's also mm -hmm. an NPC. I don't really. It's not. You know. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna roll is boring. Right here we go. We're gonna we're gonna keep him in the back. Yeah. All right, he's back here trying to figure out what's going on. He doesn't want to be left up there in the graveyard with this giant yeah. fire going on, right? Yeah. So Sammy peeks through the door, and he sees three people in here in the church. They look like regular people. They look like regular people, and they're very well-dressed. Interesting. Mm -hmm. um, all right. Um Hmm. All right. Um can Well, they they don't look like zombies. No, they do not look like zombies. No, they don't. Yeah, well, we can't attack them then with this without knowing who they are. All right. Um well, then um um Sammy's going to tell everybody to um uh, just like be quiet. He's got a charisma fourteen. Um, he's gonna he's gonna he's gonna open up the 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 door, but kind of stick his head out a little bit. Not okay. like put his not 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 expose his whole body. Okay. And uh, say, um, we're dealing with a little bit of an instant in the back here. Um, do you mind waiting for the priest? <laughs> uh, one of the people shout. Um. 
We're looking for Father Orton. We need Father Orton. Um, Sammy. Uh, okay, we open the door. We we come out. Um, one by one, with Father Father Arden being be, being last. Okay, so you guys just all kind of move out here. Yeah. Look at what's going on? Okay, and then finally, I guess bring up the wrist, Father Arden. Yeah. Yeah. She go, he goes, oh my God, Alex, Tristan, Maya, what are you doing here? What are you children out here doing at this hour? They're children, okay. Um, teens, mm. sort of. Everybody's okay. a ch- um, child to Father yeah, Arden. Yeah. yeah, right. He's like really old. <laughs> he goes, um, it's Father. Father's taken great ill. Mom's by his side, but something's wrong with him. His eyes, like, they turn white, and he's he's like laying in the bed and. We got really, really worried, and we tied him down. And something's horribly wrong with that. He's, he's, he's. We're, we're scared. He, he something's wrong with him. Oh, oh my God. I, 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 I need. We, we need to go immediately. Um. Uh, uh, Benedict says we serve at your pleasure. Um. Larry just sort of, um, sort of grumbles. All right. So yeah. Um. We uh. We gear up and we father we will follow them. Okay, so they take you to. Uh, uh, keep in mind, we're right here at the church. Yeah, they right. they, yeah. they walk you all the way over to the Alston Estate, which is the biggest um, house, right? So okay. Large estate. Williford has two stories in height and the finest home in town. The stone foundation and wood roof it was obviously expensive to construct. Glass windows look out from both the uh, first and second floor. State surrounded by groves of fruit trees for as far as the eye can see. It just goes on and on and on, right? All the way out back. <laughs> then they have this rich crop area. So they take you in there and- um, Oh, and um, just by the way, Benedict is never letting Father Arden be more than five feet away from him. Okay, five feet right? The other guys, but I'm just letting you know, Benedict's acting as Father Arden's bodyguard. Okay, so they take him in there, and then uh, they see the uh, – they go into the house, and you hear these really horrible grunting and loud noises and everything going on, and you're, you're trying to figure out – you know, it just sounds yeah weird. It sounds – something's really, really bad. They walk in, and sure enough, they have this man tied down on the bed. He's like struggling, trying to pull himself free, right? His eyes are he's, – he's got hair like structure coming all off his face that you can tell – Something's wrong here, yeah. right? The 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 wife, um, she keeps trying to put a wet cloth on his forehead. Every time she does it, he tries biting at her hand. Yeah, and she's Benedict. all she's all crying and freaking out the whole time, not knowing what to do. It's kind of a mess. Let's put it that Larry, way. Yeah. Larry, um, basically moves her the wife away from the husband and okay. says, uh, and Benedict says, "You don't want to be bit." Um, he's he's been he's turning into a were rat. Um, were rat. What, what do you mean a were rat? What's what, what are you talking about? So uh, I guess we could just I can yeah. easily make a little tiny thing for this thing. But yeah, what do you mean were rat? What are you talking about? Father's okay. Nothing's wrong with father. No, uh, he's or, um he's uh has 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 he recently been in contact with anybody that's been to the well? Uh, uh, we don't know. It's it's he went out. And he had business over at um the uh, the uh. I think he said he had to go meet with uh, uh, the Lons. They, they're a, a breeding family, they're a horse breeder farm. I, I, I don't know. I mean, this I really yeah. don't remember too much. I mean, he said he had to go out. He had business he had to tend to. And then I don't know. I mean, honestly, I'm really not sure. I mean, I am, I'm worried for my father, but I can't remember uh, – where he said he was going, I, I know that that's one place that he, I, and then, and the mother that, you know, her name's Heath, so she's like really just mm-hmm. crying her eyes out at this time. She's yeah. all freaked out because her husband is in the throes of a whole bunch of pain and yeah. he's, he's freaking out like you would believe, right? Um, right. Yeah. Um, okay. Um, Larry, I don't want to use it right now. Um, but okay. I, I'm, I want to pull out, well, I want to just pull out my, my bunch of Wolfsbane. I'm not going to rub it on anything. I just want to see what this guy's reaction is to it. Ooh. Uh, when I pull okay. it out. So I, when you pull out Wolfsbane, um, he's 
starts to pant very furiously, right? Uh, yeah, I put uh, it away. I put it away. <laughs> yeah, um, Larry. Larry says it's definitely it. This is he's. This is um, he's turning into a were rat. Um, um, yeah. Okay. Um, so uh, the question is. Um, Oh no! Benedict pulls uh, Father Arden off to the side. Okay, he, he's trying to talk to him quietly. I don't know, but but he's also he has a charisma of three, so he may not be talking as quiet as he should be. Um, <laughs> but he says, uh, "Do we you want us to dispose of him, or do you want us to try to find the source?" That's yeah. horrible. Yeah, uh, but Benedict, but this he's Mar Benedict's martial class. So this is what he does, right? Um, he's he he's he 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 does the dirty business that the church doesn't that wants him to do. But he says, "Or do you want us to just try to secure him tightly and try to find the source of the evil in the um we there's some rooms we still haven't gotten to, um, and maybe there's a source of this evil up there that we need to purge." Um, and I, I don't know if it's going to cure him, though. Yeah, it's it's kind of a, how would you say? A, uh, so you're saying this to Father? Yeah, to the, Father Arden. Uh, yeah. There has to be some way. I cannot let, I've taken care of him for this family for years. We just can't let him die. This this would be horrendous. This is, you have to find a way. There has to be a way to to, to save him. Father Arden, I, I, I serve at the church's p pleasure. And uh, in this case, you are, uh, you are the leading member of the church here. I will, we will do everything that we, that we, that we, that we can. Um, uh, so, um, children guess, all huddled over here in the corner, and they're starting to cry a little bit. Yeah. They kind of overhearing the word "disposed" coming yeah. down the hallway here. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> No, yeah. What do you think about your dad being disposed? Yeah. But, yeah. yeah. Sammy's less eyeballing him, but 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 um but Ramsey's and Larry but they're runs up and grabs on the Benedicts. Save him. Save my husband. Save him. Okay, then um then uh Benedict rec recommends that um um no one um basically leave him in the room, do not tend to him, do not let him bite you. Um, it is, that's if, um, apparently, um, now, that's how it happens right now. It's, it's, yeah, it's, dark, it's nighttime. So yeah. On, right? yeah. Yeah. So, so we, we just got to make sure that he, that he, that he survives the sunlight. Um, so we are going to tie him down again, okay. make sure that he's, that he's, that he's, that he's, that he's, that he's tied down. Reinforces um, bindings. Yeah. Yes. Okay. And then, um, the, uh, Benedict says, do you want us to sleep here? Yeah, I don't know. I mean, so the church. Uh, someone's got a. Well, I don't know if. I and, and Father's kind of like talking a little bit. He says, "I I don't know um, much about this disease. I I wish I knew more. I haven't really. This is. This sounds like the whole town's becoming infested right now, and I'm like really yes. really worried. And there's. I don't know if there's like. Uh, I don't know what to expect. Yes. Um, well, I this is the first time that I've experienced, but what for what we've seen in the um, in the well, um, he he starts to actually howl. Oh, like like a wolf, not like yeah. a rat. Oh, Benedict says that's different. Um, <laughs> that's 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 not rat like. That's uh, wolf like. Um, but it's still lycanthropy. Um, Can you give me everybody who's who's got? Let's do wisdom checks on these people for sure. one second. Yeah. All right. Um, so with Benedict, if I'm not mistaken, he gets. Does he get two or three? He's a. He's, I think he's. Just oh, three. I should. I should look at the thing, and I should tell you. Wait, one second. Skill. Here you go. Uh, Benedict would get a two. With Benedict the two. Well, Benedict gets a two. And so does oh. Larry. Larry, well, Benedict rolled a two and a six. Okay. Larry rolled a two and a six. Um, let's okay. see. Okay, cool. No, that's fine. That's all you need. Okay. Um, oh, everybody else failed. Uh, both you guys are now looking in. There's glass windows all around here. It's a very fancy okay. house. Yeah. You can see 
lanterns and torches of it looks like the people of Williford milling about in the streets because they keep hearing this howling sound. Mm. Okay, um, Father Arden, I think um, you need to uh, calm the town peoples down. Um, so let's go. Let's go talk with the town people. Um, Larry, um, stay with uh, Alec and. Um, no, well, I, I tell you what, Ramsey, stay with Alec because he's an elf and they don't trust elves. Um, <laughs> so, <laughs> okay. Sammy, uh, Ramsey is going to stay there, and Larry and Benedict are going to go out um, with the father to talk to the townspeople. Okay. All right. So, Larry, Benedict, mm -hmm. yeah, and obviously, uh, father. I'm yep. going to go out there and approach the situation. What's yep. Sammy doing? He's talking to the children. No, 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 no. Sammy's going to, Sammy's, Sammy's, Sammy's going to go out too. As a matter of fact, Sammy's going to do most, most of the talking. Because the Sammy, little man? All right. Yeah, because Sammy, ahead. that's what Sammy does. Puts okay, his right, thumbs right. in his front of his belt and he stands in front of the father before the father even starts talking. And he says, okay. so howdy folks. Everybody's up late, it seems. <laughs> All right, so when he goes into his speech, immediately someone yells, they say, we hear there's a wolf in there. We don't want our sheep eaten. If these people have a wolf for a pet, we know that that's against the town folk of Williford. You cannot have wolves as pets. I don't care if it does protect his crops. I'm telling you right now, you cannot have a wolf. We hear him. So Sammy, um, Sammy puts his thumbs in the front of his belt and kind of leans back real back, and he says... Yeah. Has anybody, did everybody trust Father Arden, right? Father Arden has never lied to you. And they all kind of shrug. Yeah, I guess not. Yeah, all right. he doesn't lie. No. Uh, yeah. uh, Father Arden, is is there a wolf in that house? If Father Arden kind of looks, he's got his eyes all big and wide, and yeah. he goes, did you well, see? Did you see a oh, dog? God. Did you see a four-legged dog in there? He's... <laughs> He's like, he leans into Sammy. He says, Sammy, I, I, I don't feel comfortable not telling these people. Don't, can you leave me out of this part of it? I, I, I don't feel comfortable reassuring these people that this is, I, I, then he kind of moves back a little bit and he just kind of, he stops talking. He just kind of sits there and starts scratching his head. He's like, oh. Well, what we think's happening is, um, the the master of the house is having a really really loud dream of being a being a wolf, um and he and he is howling, um but there's something else that's going on here. Um, how many of you family members, how many of you families are missing family members? They all kind of look around a little bit. Well, people leave Williford. People don't stay here very long before they decide they want to go off and find oh, bigger yeah. adventure. Well, I understand that, but I mean, how many of you recently have lost family members? They all kind of shrug a little bit. They kind of don't want to answer, I guess, more or less. Okay. Well, this is what I'm going to need everybody to do. I need you all to go home right now. I need you to take count of your family members, figure out who's been missing, right? I need want you to lock your doors, shut everything down. Stay inside tonight, and we're going to meet in the center square in the morning. All right, disperse. Go. Let's see those, let's see those rolls. What you get? Two rolls? What you yeah. get? Sammy's, you get to... Sammy's just expecting them to do it. Sammy gets a one. It's Christmas. What does he have for his? Oh, it's race step at two. 14, That's right. 14. Okay, yeah, yeah. Go ahead. All right. I rolled two threes. <laughs> these, these people don't know you. Yeah. They don't know where you're from. And now they're kind of worried about the fact that father's standing there and he's kind of looking around all nervously and he keeps scratching his head like something's the matter here. All right. And these people are now sitting there saying, I'm, they, they got literally pitchforks and torches here. Yeah. They go, <clears throat> one of the ones in the front, his name's Argar, right? Sammy, Sammy turns the father. And Argar, they stay around and they say, hmm. how about this? We man, right? He said, uh, "Let us uh, let us come in, and then uh, we can uh, assure everybody that everything is okay. Just me, just Argar Ingrid. 
both of us. It's it's a, it's a they're they're um they're from the Wolf Homestead. Okay. Oh. Well, this may be kind of telling. All right. Um. Then um. Uh, yeah. All right. Um. Sammy says. Sounds good to me, but man, you guys sure aren't Shire folks. Shire folks would just go back home. All right. All right. <laughs> so we're going to go in. Um, All right. And then you have uh, Agar, right? Now, these two yeah. people, um, they have like, uh, it looks like they have what appears to be a cloak over top of stuff that looks a little bit like uh, uh, they're concealing stuff. Like, yeah, they're like a, they're like they're like wolves in sheep's clothing. Yeah. Oh okay. no 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 no. Well, uh, yeah, I guess if you want to go with that. Okay, fine. Um, <laughs> okay, so oh, yeah, uh, we 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 know where this is going, but let's just let's just get there. Um, all right. right. They, so, so, they come in. Uh, both Ingrid and Agar come in to take a look. Who's everybody's in the room? I take it at this point. Yeah, Who's and gonna um, happen or... um, Sammy is going to be standing. Benedict's. Benedict's going to be by Agar and Sammy's going to be by Ingrid. Benedict's by Agar. Okay. Yeah. And where's behind him? <laughs> okay. He's going to turn on him, and Sammy's going to be behind Ingrid. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I think when they walk be... up, I, I, and could you roll a d6 dice real quick? Yeah. Sure. Why not? Why not? Um, yeah. I rolled a four. So Good, because I rolled a three. So yeah. before you even have a chance to blink, these people swing open their cloaks, which is a long robe with a hood kind of thing, but the hood's down. It doesn't look like a thing. And they stab Alex with daggers. All right. Okay. The thing starts to howl and then it just dies. Okay. And they stop for a second and look back, and he says, you're just playing with yourself if you thought you could change what was going to happen. Um, Benedict says, what was going to happen? He would have easily broken these binds somewhere during the night and probably slaughtered his whole family. You have no idea what you're playing with. Well, inform us, because we need to know. He says, we've been investigating. We have lived in this town for years. This town has always been plagued with some kind of lycanthropy that's been running through here. And when we heard the howls from above, we immediately suited up, came down here, and decided to take care of a problem that Father Arden would never, ever take care of. There's a point where you must put blade to test. They kind of turn around and they wipe the blades off on their cloaks down at the tail end. And they kind of push their way through. No, the no, no. Benedict stands in front of them. Benedict's okay. not going to let him push okay. Benedict is standing right in front of them. And Benedict's okay. going to say, as the marshal class for the order of the, of the light, that is why I was sent here. There were were rats that are in the well. We've disposed with a number of them. But this is different. These are wolves. These aren't rats. So there's more. There's a different type of lycanthropy around here besides the rats. Well, I'm sure that once lycanthropy gets a stronghold, it just keeps changing. Everything is going to keep getting worse unless you eradicate the problem. Lycanthropy is almost a disease. It's more of a disease or a curse, and no one really knows. But if you're not getting rid of it, it just keeps getting so, worse. It changes. So- Agar. As it goes through people. I understand Agar, but so then what is it we're looking for? Is it something in the well we're looking for? Is it an item? Is it a person? Is it a being? Is it um, uh, a magic eye? What is it that we need to destroy? And I will see it done. So, so Agar looks at Ingrid and Ingrid looks at Agar and said, we're looking, you got to look for the prime host. You got to look for the one that actually started this outbreak. 
Okay. He's the one. Sometimes they call it the Rat King. Sometimes they call it a, a bunch of different things. You must get rid of him. If you don't get rid of him, it's just going to keep blossoming and getting worse. But um, whether he's even there or not, we don't know. But usually he must be there because this is a change. This is a bad change that's happening. Um, I give I give Agar a... a, a if we're going to be honest lesson. with each other, I must tell you my real name is Scale and her, her name's Shell. We're Red Bank. We are from a city. We were once hired let's say exterminators. We came to Williford because it's a quiet town, started farming, and now we're seeing this occur. We're not moving. This is our town. However, we're not going to put up with this kind of mumbo jumbo. We can cure them. There's the cure is eradication. We have seen this happen in the sewers of, of our town and home. We have seen this happen several different places. The only way to stop this is to basically exterminate. Well, are you willing to take a trip with us in, into the into the wells and to finish this for good? They both look at each other, look back, and they say, we have to decide whether we want to stay in Wilford. Well, and if you don't mind at this point, me and Ingrid, that's what we're going by now, We'd like to return home. I say, um, peace be upon you and have a good night and thank you for your service. And I step step aside. Okay. So um, they're going to go ahead and they're going to take off. Ingrid, just to show you how awesome she is, uh, yeah. turns invisible and disappears. Well, they would have been helpful. All right. Um, <laughs> um <laughs> They're actually in this book, which I think is kind of cool. We put this in there. Well, I mean, we're going to go with this, but yeah. I was like, oh, my God, this would be a fun player put it here. Wait, okay. Wait. Well, so um, so um, Benedict turns to father and says, um, you might you might want to clean that up and let's. Ex oh, no, the wife was in there. She's, she's she saw the whole thing. She's traumatized. Yeah. She just saw yeah. her husband get stabbed by silver yeah. daggers, actually magical daggers. And uh, yeah. yeah, he's not there no yeah. more. Yeah. Um, so um, Benedict um, tells father they're going to go back to the church and they're they're going to rest up and they're going to go to the um, finish. They're going to finish this in the morning. Okay. And we leave. as you're going out, the children yeah. start. Is father going to be okay? <laughs> <laughs> we leave father Arden to deal with father, it. That's father that's... Arden starts to just basically sit there and uh, just kind of say, uh, uh. Okay, uh, I'll, he's going to be quieter I'll, now. <laughs> okay, I'll, okay. Benedict will stay with the father. Larry, Sammy, and Ramsey are going back to the inn. Benedict is going to always stay within five feet of the father. Okay, fair enough. All right, yeah. so he's he's hanging back. These yeah. two discuss this thing with the children, right? Yeah. You guys go back to the town, and obviously mm -hmm. you're going back to the church. The three of them go back to the church. They start setting up their bed. Um clean they clean kind of clean up yeah they're gonna they gotta rest i mean right. um, so they're gonna be able to rest i mean this is a lot of activity for one night so yeah. everyone's gonna gain back one hit point whoever's down gets a hit point so go ahead okay uh, ramsey fuel is, them up. ramsey is, is back to normal because he has down one okay. larry is down he was down three so now he's down two okay benedict unfortunately oh damn I didn't realize Benedict was hit. But yeah, Benedict, yeah, because he got hit. Like the, he, was, he was down six, so he's down five. Okay. What does he, but he's second level. He's got a little more than nobody else, doesn't he? he? He does. So the question is, in the morning, do I heal? Do I cast that heal? Hmm. No. I'll wait. Yeah. Well, you know what I'll do in the, in the morning? I'll ask Father Arden if he can heal me. Oh, okay. That's true. He's got a couple. Yeah. One he's... He's second level as well. All right. I'm sorry. I have a no got some kind of something that was on the table. I got my hand on it. I, got a, <laughs> I totally yeah. just hear off screen. Sorry so, about that. <laughs> so 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 in the so yeah in the in the morning Benedict is going to um while he's saying his morning prayers he, with Father Arden he's going to ask if Father Arden could lay hands on him. Okay. So uh, yeah, Father Arden turns around and says, "I bless you, my child, with." Uh, 
we don't do one. Oh, he gets six hit points back. Oh, nice. He's fully okay, healed. Right. Okay, cool. And uh, you guys uh, understand you have like this humongous adventure still left in you. And yes. you do know that you did have like the map. Yeah, that's the thing is, yeah, we're going to, we're going to, the, the, in the evening, we were we're going to study the map. We're going to see what rooms we didn't go into, and okay. we're going to and we're going to come up with a plan. And um, our plan is bold. Okay, I like bold. Go ahead. Instead of going down the well, mm -hmm. we're going to go in that back door. Even though okay. we we're we are expecting a trap, you know those yeah. vines. We're expecting yeah. we are we are expecting to be attacked by were rats but our 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 plan is to go in that backside and um i mean i yeah i mean following the numbers our plan is because we've been through everything else um i think you, know, you didn't confirm it but i i believe that where number 15 was was where that rust monster was there was something there was a thing chewing on a shield i i remember running from it because i didn't want it eating my plus one chain mill <laughs> um that's 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 why we ran i'll be honest with you it's the only thing i got going for me is this magic chain mill um so um yeah no we um so we're gonna got so what we're gonna do is we're going to go up to the hill i mean and we're gonna go around the side of the hill larry our ranger is going to be looking for um hopefully looking to see if there's if they set up some sort of ambush or if there's someone spying okay. around the okay. entrance to number seven cool all right so moving at the speed of plot yeah <laughs> um you guys simply wake up the next morning move up the yeah. hill right da, 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 yeah. da, going all the way up to the well house which is up here on 21 okay yeah. uh and, and, and we and we take it that um our two hunters didn't meet us in the square no they probably didn't no that's fine no. They're not going to meet you. They They're not going to meet you. Yeah. All right. So as you move all the way up to um, uh, the entrance way, mm -hmm. okay, you guys are kind of um, obviously the rangers really cued into anything being there, right? Yeah. I keep in mind this. I guess it's been a while, right? So it's um, been it's been one evening. Yes, one evening. <laughs> but it's been hours. Yes, it that, was, that um, is true. Yeah. That is true. So. Uh, yeah, so they kind of like, you know, as you're going up there, you um, once again have to kind of find the passage. And if you want the ranger to do this thing, he yeah. has like, uh, his wisdom is what? Two dice? His uh, wisdom is two dice, but as a... Uh, he gets a bonus for a ranger skim, 3d6. Let's see if he finds easily the entrance to finding a 3d6 roll, one or two. Is what you get, or do you want me right? to do my forestry thing? It's one or two out of a six. Well, actually, you your odds are way better if you yeah. roll... D6 is yeah, that's, that's true. Two. That's true. Okay. Hey, I did it. I got a one, two, and a three. So, oh anyway. my god! All right, so you have no problem. You easily find this, the hidden exit or whatever yeah. it was, right? Yeah. <clears throat> so as you kind of enter the area, there's no ambush. There's nothing there. You kind of go through the vines. It's, it's mm. pretty easy, right? Um, but you kind of like as you're walking through. Where's my light of illumination? How's okay. So illuminate? what 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 we are going to do? Um, for the light, um, Ramses is going to cast um, use that 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 wand of light. Okay. I've got nine charges. So All as right. we get in, he's going to cast it, and he's going to kind of stick. He does. Does he have to hold the wand for it to be going on? I think he just can cast it and put it aside, right? And it uh, floats above him. I believe if, he can. Yeah, it lasts for like two hours. Yeah. So 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 he's just gonna cast it and it's gonna float above his head and that way that they, they all can have access to their items. So that's another charge. Okay. He's down all to right. eight charges. All right. So yeah, it's gonna last for I what did we say? It was three rooms? That seemed right. It's not like that. I, I was it, four, it was four it. rooms. It was four, four rooms. Oh, okay. Four rooms. Okay. So seven is your entrance. Okay, that's yeah. one. And obviously you're gonna go into that bigger room. It goes four before you have to recast, right? Okay. Uh, do you have a marching order for me? Yes, we sure do. Um, we are going to. Um, oh, I should put the heavy guy in front, but I'm not going to. Um, okay. Um, um, yeah. All right. Larry's going to die, but Larry's going to go first. Then it's then it's going to be. Um, 
Uh, then it's going to be Sammy. Okay. Then it's going to be um, Benedict and Ramsey is going to be coming up the rear. Okay. okay. Benedict and Ramsey. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Ooh, let me do that. Let's take that out. Okay, okay. Larry, because of, of his ranger ability, and okay. Sammy, because of his dexterity. Fair enough, fair enough. Okay. Yeah. Um. All right, so obviously we've been to this big yeah. area. It's totally vacant. Global light, I guess, is over top of who's at Ramsey's head the whole time, yeah. right? Yeah. And uh, it illuminates this giant chasm that's fairly large, right? Um. Where would you like to go? We are going to go. Um, we're going to hug the um, the the north wall, um, and we're going to. Well, okay. So that number six. I mean, we're going to kind of peer over there. What does it? Is that? Is that it's actually a pond? Okay. An underground pond. We're going to leave it alone. The, I, the I, water not... is super surprisingly clear, actually. Way clearer than where you came down in one. Nice. Well, I guess they've got a drink. They've got to have water. So maybe that's right. where. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm not even going to mess with it. We got um because source of yeah. There's not going to be. That's not going to be in there. Um, we're gonna we're gonna go up um that that yeah that thing. Okay. So as you start to go up, mm -hmm. uh, yeah, you just kind of. Checking right along. Yeah. I, I didn't mean to scare you. I just rolled dice. But anyways, That's right. um, you see what appears to be a giant garbage pit. Ooh. Right? S the stairs wind slowly upward, come to a landing before continuing their ascent. There's a bubbling noise and a foul odor coming from the darkness below. Right? It's all in there, right? And the pit descends beyond the light of your um, torches, lanterns, or whatever you're using. So it's a giant garbage pit that goes down. Right. It's a garbage pit. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Part of me is just saying keep on going. Um Yeah, uh, you do see tiny stuff down there, just FYI, if you're interested. But yeah, uh, yeah. Sammy's very, very in, in, interested, but um Larry slaps him on the back of the head and says, <laughs> Eyes on the prize. Cool. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna Eye on the prize. <laughs> we're gonna keep going up. And I guess we get to, I mean, it's marked there. I don't want to metagame, but I guess it, there's a secret door. We see it on the map, but you I mean. You come to a, an end stop. of a halt, but okay. yeah, you, you know that somehow it has to keep going based on the well, map. You have, well, right? for, for gaming purposes, we'll have Ramsey's, um, the elf, look to see if he can detect the secret door. He's got a one and a four to do it. Okay, you could do it. Sure. Yeah, yeah, he's got a two. Nice. Okay, so. Yeah. um. However, uh, he finds the secret door, but he also hears like oh. sounds of screams. Oh, good golly! That are coming from inside that room. All right. Um. Okay. Um. All right. Um. We are. We are. Um. Well. We are sources of goodness. All right. So Ramsey steps away. Um, Benedict's going in first. Um, we're going right, to open. Do so, so Ramsey's, Sammy, and Larry are all cocking um arrows, and Benedict with sword in hand, shield. We're opening the door, and Benedict's just charging in. Okay, so say it again slowly. Arrow, sure. These okay. Guys, so, you guys arrows. So, so Sammy, Larry, yeah. and Ramsey's all have their bows out. Gotcha. All they're, right. They're 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 planning on popping in after Benedict and firing arrows because they heard screaming. But um Benedict um with his magic chain mail and shield and his holy sword, he is going to just we're we're open the door, we're charging, and we are Oh come on now. What? Oh, I don't want that. Obviously, I'm we hitting are, the wrong we button. Are, Not doing good here right now. Wait, was I? Boom. Well, I like the cloud. It's the. It is the fog of war for some reason. Why is this not working? I guess I'm. Okay, I did it again. 
That's fine. I'm just going to put these guys down here. Um, boom. Token. Boom. Okay, cool. All right. So as you guys come charging in, right? Mm -hmm. Benedict's coming charging in, right? Mm -hmm. He sees two humanoid-looking things whipping mm -hmm. another humanoid right, as the thing is chained to the wall. So he's, his back is to you, and they're, they're whipping this. It's a smaller-looking humanoid thing. I mean, the rate at which you guys are piling into the room, it's really kind of hard to make things out. These things have whips in their hands, and they turn around. But you guys got the surprise. They didn't know you were there. So I sure. guess Benedict would go first yeah. based on – okay, so it's actually a narrow pass. So I don't know if they all can come in like that. Whole thing, yeah, but so basically – Who was Sam first? Okay, okay it's going to well, be Benedict and then Sammy. Okay. And then Larry after Sammy, so he can hopefully fire over him and Ramsey behind him. Okay, all right. So Benedict comes charging in. Okay, yeah. he's going to probably do his thing first. Okay, yeah, go ahead. Benedict's going to swing on whatever the hell is whipping. Yeah. <laughs> Natural 20. I'm not, wow. Okay, okay. All right. So, That's yeah, awesome. go ahead and roll for uh, actually what is damage? You're going to actually decapitate this thing. Yeah, oh, nice. Wham. All right. So that thing's totally taken out. It's dropped. Okay. Yeah. Uh, all right. I guess Sammy's in the door. Sammy. Yeah. Sammy's going to pop two arrows into the other thing that has a whip. Mm -hmm. Um. Wow. Oh, damn. Okay. Um. Uh, the, I rolled a four, so that's going to be a miss, but I rolled a 10. 10 plus three is 13. Does a 13 hit? Uh, no, it doesn't actually. That's going to okay. be. Okay. So that's two misses. <laughs> okay. Damn it, Sammy. So it's going to actually, now uh, we got to roll for initiative to see yeah. if this thing's going to do. I rolled a six. I rolled a five. So okay. you got it. Right. Uh, he drops his whip and runs immediately into room number 10. Oh, that son of a gun. So there's an open door. Where's the door? Uh, I'm sorry, right here. So he came in and went right into here. They were doing the whipping right up in here. He's in that room. Yeah, he left. Okay. Um, so we, we can just imagine this guy, he's going that way. Benedict, I okay, this is not... Benedict's... Maybe, this isn't the smartest thing in the world. I'm, I'm, I'm fully admitting that. But Benedict's going to chase after him. Evil okay. Is, evil is running away, and Sammy's going to chase after Benedict. Larry is going to be frustrated and chase after Sammy, and Ramsey is going to grunt and chase chase after Larry. So we are we are we are hightailing it into the other room. Okay. And leaving this uh, creature. So does it? As I'm running through this room, what does this room look like? I mean, is it like a bed chamber? It looks like a it... torture chamber. Oh, hopefully. <laughs> <laughs> just thought I'd let you know. Uh, okay, yeah. it's a torture chamber. Okay. Yeah. Nice and, to... uh, yeah. From what you could tell, all right, if you can imagine, um, uh, it is. I gotta put that. Oh, whoa, 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 let's put that there. It doesn't matter. Oh, yeah. Control Z. I'm sorry. That's the edge. I want. Boom. Okay. Cool. So he <laughs> comes into the door. I guess I could take out one of these edges. You can see where he went. Okay. Uh, I'm, I'm doing my best here, which never seems good enough. <laughs> so, I, I just, nice to know we just went into a torture chamber. Okay. okay I, <laughs> so he's just darting in. Benedict is like, the heck with this. Ben, Benedict, right ben, Benedict is, is going after him. <laughs> okay, I keep, all right, let's go back. Gotcha. I'm on token. All right, boom. I mean, all right, no, he's hope, going hopefully in. Hopefully right. Benedict can take a swing at him, but we'll see if we oh, can. Heck, I this guy's dead. I grabbed the wrong guy. Okay, Benedict. Okay, boom. He's going to go in. Yeah. All right. Um, once he gets into here, he sees unmistakably an amazing problem ahead of him. Sure. Okay. Um, he sees. I got to put all this out. Okay. This is gonna. This gonna be a, a slight bit of suckage here. Let's yeah. try this out, right? Uh, I'll make them all the same color. So. Yeah. I, I I never said Benedict was the smartest guy in the world. He's no. not. Come on. Oh, there we go. Like I just changed colors on me. Did I ask it to do that? It's weird. Oh. All right. And W1. W2. W3. 
W, oh, sorry, W3, oh, come on now. W3, I don't really don't understand why I'm having a little bit of a weird thing here. Wait, one, two, three. Oh, interesting. <laughs> got, got a little bit of a mess here. We're going to see how this works out for you. Wait, hold a second. I can't tell the difference in some of these colors, so that's why I got to put uh, letters on this. Okay, here we go. All right. All right, now we're ready for fun, okay? Okay. So, uh, yeah, you got the Benedict comes rushing in. This is the guy yeah. that escaped, all right? So I'm going to call him T1 for torture one. The other guy's dead. Who cares, all right? So, uh, he comes in and he screams and he points behind, all right, showing Benedict entering the room. Okay, all so right. uh, this will be fun, right? Um, roll a d6. I rolled a two. I'm not gonna lie about that. What'd you get? I rolled a five. All right. Yeah. So Benedict, you have what appears to be three three were rats down here, mm. three giant rats over here, and a goblin over here in here. So. Rat one, two, and three. Werewolf one, two, and three. Goblin over here. You're running in the room. What you got? All right. Um, why is there a goblin? Okay, interesting. Um, and this right. guy that's been tortured right here is definitely a goblin. That guy's a goblin. Gotcha. Okay. Um, We're going to pause right here. Yeah. Got it? Okay. Good place. All right. All right. Yeah, then you can figure out what you're going to do. How are you going to die? Yeah. <laughs> 